Namaskaram everyone. Our journey as human beings has always been evolving. When we talk of evolution, it's not just morphological. Primarily, it is at a mental level, at a consciousness level. When individuals with the heart-oriented feelings, with spiritual bent of mind, they all come together and form an aggregate of consciousness. This triggers the kind of mutation in our journey for a better human beings. Why am I referring to better human beings? Because though inside, though from inside, we are all good people. All are good human beings. At times we don't recognize the beauty that dwells within us because we are distracted by the life's difficulties and end up doing this thing or the other thing that compromises our integrity. For example, an industrialist somehow prone towards air pollution out of greed or land pollution, water and air pollution. So many levels of pollution occurs. The yoga calls us, recalls us time and again, beckons us to lead a life as per the advice of our ancient system, yama and niyama, what not to do and what to do. And this comes from an evolved mind. When the thought pollution is reduced, when thought pollution is totally curbed, we will find a day when we will not create other pollutions, be it sound pollution, air pollution, water pollution, or land. Our efforts at Heartfulness Organizations have been largely recognized with this award. On behalf of Sri Ramchandra Mission, it is my privilege to receive this award. I am thankful to the Government of India and Government of Telangana for recognizing the efforts of Heartfulness Institute run under the guidance of Sri Ramchandra Mission and we are ever grateful to have been awarded this uh, Padma Pushan and for which we remain grateful to all those who had made the selection and I am also grateful to all the volunteers, the great organizers of this organization Sri Ramchandra Mission who has been volunteering for, since 1873 and they don't charge any money and thank God that it has been finally recognized after 150 years. We are looking forward to uplifting the consciousness, changing the bent of mind, bent of thinking and attitude of human beings so that we can coexist. We form a united humanity who can heartfully dwell together, evolve together through yogic sadhana. Thank you.